Yeah, my name's Ash Walker, and along with my good wife, Lib, we own and operate the Armatory Hotel in the central west slopes and plains of New South Wales. Armatory is about 40 kilometres north of Gilgandra, about 500 k's west of Sydney. Um, I'm also the Deputy Mayor of the Gilgandra Shire Council, which covers about 5,000 square kilometres of uh, New South Wales. We wanted to create you know, a beautiful country pub with great hospitality and, and good experiences and, and from that we've been lucky. Um, we've won numerous awards um, over the last two years. We've, um, we've won the best bush hotel in New South Wales for two years in a row, uh, which is pretty exciting. And it's also very rewarding for not only us as, as business owners, but our staff. And it also makes our community really proud of the venue that we have and it's their local. Um, life before COVID was, um, you know, every day, pubs open, trading, um, you know, we got wedding bookings, you know, we had concerts booked in, we had Brad Butcher, Felicity Urquhart, Blake O'Connor, those sorts of artists all booked in on the one day for an event called Tracks at the Tree. And literally on a Sunday night, um, you know, watching TV here with the patrons and, um, the Prime Minister came on and um, basically said, you know, we're, we're closing down as of midday the next day. And it was just a, a total shock to the system. And you, you go from absolutely running flat out and all of your staff and all your suppliers and breweries and everyone in, in between um, to literally putting the handbrake on and just stopping. So we've done a lot of takeaway food for tractor drivers and spray rig drivers and those sorts of people. and. You know, and we got great support out of our local community, which you know we're, we're, we're just beautifully thankful for. I think we've also learned to care a little bit more about one another. Like everyone's sort of been probably flying their own and running their own race. Um, but as individuals, you know, I think we've learned a lot from this. Yeah, look, a lot of music here at Armitry. Um, you know, we've always trying to get ourselves, you know, a great name for Great events, um, great hospitality, iconic destination. We end up with sort of up to 750 people here uh, for these great events. And yeah, they love it, we love it, and our community loves it. Look, I think Great Southern Nights is a, is a great initiative. There's so many venues that just need that little kick at it, and there's so many artists that need that kick along to, to get back out there. Um, I think it's going to be a fantastic opportunity just for people to get back out and enjoy it. But, you know, we're here, we're going to bounce back out of this and we're going to rock and roll again. That was a terrible ending.